Go, Timber, go get him. There he goes. Get him out of here. So watching a little buck and Billy Ray chop a tree down and there's a possum on my front porch out there. That's my game. Go ahead and take care of that. He's under the porch. Go, Timber, go get him. Go run off that possum. Timber. Oh, he smells him. He definitely went under the porch. I don't know that he's still under there. Hey, let's turn back out. Let me go back down. Yeah. Uh -huh. I think it's a possibility of my gold pushing back out that way. No, he's folded the only even further. <laughs> he has all teeth out, huh? They were going going at it. Okay, so that stupid possum is still over here. I'm gonna have to get rid of him because I don't want him, you know, get a hold of my cat, Neptune. There he goes. Get him out of here. I don't want him, want him back in the woods.
We should know under the razor, under the tractors. I think we may have scared him off pretty good. Hopefully he don't come back. Some more wildlife over there. There's a bunny. Got my lights at. Look for my cat, make sure he's okay with this. There we go. Anyway, I of course locked my chickens up at night. And uh, so I don't think this possible is going to get in there and get them. I have it sealed up pretty good and I have that electric netting around it during the daytime. Uh, like I said, my cat Neptune, here he is. Come here, Neptune. That's the only one I worry about is my cat. Come here, buddy. Come on. You okay, buddy? You okay? Hmm? You okay? Oh yeah. You okay, buddy? All right. Okay, go have fun, Neptune. Hey, if that possum comes back, you let me know. <laughs>